हूँ रोशना स्पिटने शो में होस्ट रोशना द शो इज ऑल अबाउट गेटिंग यू ऑफ द काउच एंड गेटिंग यू वर्किंग आउट हमारा स्टूडियो का नंबर है फोर जीरो एट नाइन वन टू फाइव फाइव सिक्स फाइव फोर जीरो एट नाइन वन टू फाइव फाइव सिक्स फाइव आप सुन रहे हैं रोशना को रोशना स्पिटने शो पे डू कम हैवी वन स्टे बिटवीन ट्वेल्व एंड वन वी डू टेक यू लाइफ कॉल हेल्थ न्यूट्रिशन फिटनेस एक्सरसाइज वेट लॉस वेट गेन स्ट्रेंथ गेन डाइट न्यूट्रिशन देसी खाना देसी नहीं खाना कार्ब्स फैट प्रोटीन किसी भी तरह का क्वेश्चन आप डेफिनेटली मे कॉल कर सकते हैं कैलरी से रिलेटेड यू नॉट बी मोर देन हैप्पी टू टेक योर कॉल एंड हमारा स्टूडियो का नंबर है फोर जीरो एट नाइन वन टू फाइव फाइव सिक्स फाइव अगेन फोर जीरो एट नाइन वन टू फाइव फाइव सिक्स फाइव um in information about me i'm a fitness expert i'm the owner of freshness wellness that was started about you know close to 10 11 years ago here in sunnyville california and hamara jo center of course we've expanded quite a bit in terms of programs so you don't have to be living local to do any for programs hamare sare programs jo hain uh have been very well set up to be done from wherever that you live if you are not local and you cannot physically come down to my sunnyville location you definitely welcome to enroll a lot of a um, lot of these programs specifically naming we do have an ultimate fat burner which is actually special designed um to be done from home and there is a batch of that starting this coming monday so starting a you know brand new batch is starting this coming monday of uh, ultimate fat burn it's a three month course like the name says it all it's called an ultimate fat burner agar aapko information chahiye aap call kar sakte hain apni website pe iska um you know thoda sa video bhi aapko milega if you go to my website rachnaradio.com if you go and click on product and services you'll get information about the program start date and also you can also you know kind of see like a small video on exactly what the program is going to be covering Okay, so again, um, the program is starting this coming Monday, which is what September twenty sixth, right? Yes, yeah, September twenty sixth. Um, starts this coming Monday. To get registered, you definitely welcome to give us a call. Four zero eight three two zero eight one one one. आपको हमारी वेबसाइट पे इनफॉरमेशन मिलेगी टू गेट इन टच विद मी. So again, the program is called an ultimate fat burner. That means I will make sure that of course we lose as much fat as possible in a very fantastic way. The program is going to make sure that you're staying on track in the holiday season. If you're the kind of person who's scared, किन हॉलीडेज में वेट पड़ जाएगा या फिर पहले से रैंप अप हो रहा है गेस दिस इज द प्रोग्राम फॉर यू बिकॉज यूल डेफिनेटली वो आर गन बी डन जस्ट अबाउट बिफोर यू नो राइट अबाउट मे बी क्रिसमस टाइम सो यूल हैव अ फेंटेस्टिक हॉलीडे सीजन स्टिल एंड अ फेंटेस्टिक न्यू ईयर हैविंग लॉस्ट अ लॉट ऑफ वेट एंड नॉट स्टारिंग द ईयर दिस वे विद यू नो गेनिंग द वेट सम Okay, so again, the program is starting this coming Monday, September twenty-six. It is called the Ultimate Fat Burner. To get registered, आप हमारी वेबसाइट पे जाके हमें कांटेक्ट कर सकते हैं, फोन कर सकते हैं. Website is Rachna Radio dot com. R A C H N A R A C H N A Rachna Radio dot com. And you can always give us a call at my um, phone number, business number four zero eight three two zero eight one 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 four zero eight three twenty eight triple one. You can also contact me through my Facebook page. Everyone is on Facebook nowadays, and Facebook page. Jaake agar aapko find Rachna's Wellness or Rachna Radio, actually to be precise, R A C H N A Rachna Radio is our uh, Facebook profile page. Agar aap wahan jaake hume dhoonenge, aap definitely aap mujhe Facebook ke through bhi contact kar sakte hain. And um, what else? So again, uh, moving on with the show studio number. Abhi call karne ke liye four zero eight nine one two five five six five. So if all of our new listeners, what is the show about? The show is all about. you know of course we've been we've talked about i've been doing the show for more than 7 years now every one stays so we've of course covered a lot and a lot and a lot of topics um and but you know nutrition research health you know of course there's a lot of stuff that keeps coming so every time i come in i talk about some health nutrition topic latest research topic i recap a lot of different topics i of course um टेल यू हाउ इम्पॉर्टेंट इट इज फॉर यू टू बी फिट आई ऑफ कोर्स रिमाइंड यू एवरी टाइम कि बहुत जरूरी है अपनी बॉडी को फिट रखना आई ऑलवेज रिमाइंड यू आई नो दीज थिंग्स आर नोन एवरी वन नोज अबार इट यू नो फिटनेस है बट यू नो एक वो हल्का हल्का जो रिमाइंडर होता है अब कई लोगों को बहुत चाहिए होता है एंड दैट कीप्स यू ऑन ट्रैक सो दिस शो इज डेफिनेट दू नो द प्रोग्राम दट विल डेफिनेट मेक शो दैट कीप्स रिमाइंड इट यू नो डेफिन कीप रिमाइंडिंग दैट येस यू नीड टू बी यू नो फिट येस यू डेफिनेट नीड टू मेक शोर दैट यू हैविंग द राइट कैन ऑफ मील्स येस यू डेफिनेट नीड टू मेक मेक शोर दैट यूर एक्सरसाइजिंग द राइट टाइम and right kind of exercise you want to make sure that you do not start on um or stay on all these medications because you know of course the medications do have a lot of side effect okay so i have had a lot of people who've done my programs and i'm proud to say that then they were 
um, people who've been on all kind of medications, let's say um, diabetes medication, insulin medication, triglycerides, cholesterol, and after doing you know some months of courses with me, they did not have to take medications anymore. And that's, I'm proud to say that. A lot of people have actually shared that with me. And I'm happy to share that on ASA again, if those are the kind of results you're looking for. Or in general, you just want to be healthy. Or in general, you want to lose weight. Again, they have, I do have many different programs. Um, call kar sakte hain, mujhse baat karne ke liye, but again, precisely to mention we do have a complete three-month course called an ultimate fat burner ultimate fat burner it is starting this coming monday and september 26 to get registered give me a call 408-320-8111-408-320-8111 website is rachnaradio.com r-a-c-h-n-a rachnaradio.com Okay, story number abhi ka hai 408-912-5565, 408-912-5565, okay. Um, something just I wanted to, you know, of course there are a couple of different topics I have in my mind today, but there's something I wanted to start the show today with um, a question that was, you know, I was talking with someone else, I'm like maybe I should talk about this on here, is, um, you know, hum log bahut jab aate ki baat karte hain, flower ki baat karte hain, the only thing that mostly comes to our mind is, you know, hamara the wheat flower, you know. Um, but there's so many different flowers available in the market nowadays and um, it's kind of a confusion, especially for people who are looking to, you know, explore different options, um, who are looking to maybe make a combination of protein, not just stick to basic wheat flour, um, or for people in general who could be having some kind of gluten sensitivity, or for people in general looking to lose weight, of course, there are flowers of pretty much everything available. I mean, I've seen banana flower also, the green uh, banana flower. I mean, they're just everything available out there. You know, there are, you know, anything that is food can somehow be converted in some kind of flower, right? Now, how do we compare? Which one is better? Is our wheat flour the best? Isn't that something that we've heard for the last many years? Ki wheat flour, um, wheat bhot healthy hota hai and what not. Um, maybe not. Okay, so I'm probably going to, you know, I know I've talked about this in the past also about wheat. Um, the wheat nowadays have has changed. Um, just wanted to give a little information about that. Then I'll talk about all the different flowers and how to compare and see which one is the best. But, you know, wheat is a highly controversial topic nowadays, you know. One hand, of course, we have people who've been telling us that uh, wheat is not good, you know. And the other hand, we have our governments, our governments still telling us that it's an essential part of a balanced diet. So what's going on? Um, well, yes, it's an inescapable fact that humans, we've been consuming wheat in one form or another for thousands of years. It is an old food and most um, diet-related diseases, jitni bhi hain, wo new hai. Right? Jitni bhi ki gluten sensitivity hoti hoti hai ya wheat ki sensitivity hoti hai, wo new disease hai. For, for us to say ki wheat to hum bahut saanon se khaa rahe hai, to ab ke problem ho rahi hai. Right? I mean, if, then a lot of people will think, no, wheat ke karan nahi ho sakti because we've had generations and generations of people eating wheat, so now what's going on? Okay. The important point to realize here is that the wheat today is not the same as it was 1000 or maybe 60 to 50 years ago. It has been changed quite a bit. In fact, go online, try to find the pictures of a wheat crop about 60 to 70 years ago, and you'll find that online, and try to look at the wheat crop as of today. Just the crop itself, the plant itself, just looks different. Okay, so like I said, wheat today is completely different from what it was maybe 50 years ago. Um, it's processed differently, new techniques and grain processing key, um, that kind of started around late 19th century, and... Um, of course, the reason was to create a massive amount of refined wheat just because, you know, that's how um, development with the countries, may, you know, or of course they call it development. I don't think there was any kind of development, but again, you know, to feed a lot of other, you know, a lot of people, you know, then you have to increase the quantity of quantity, ko kam, uh, hai, to cost bhi kam karni hai. so of course they have to um, do a lot of different processes, Uski processing alag tarah se hoti hai. Um, so having all that done, you know, again, like I said, I know I've talked about this in the past. I'm not going to go into quite a bit of detail in, in the, you know, what has changed, but it has changed quite a bit. So having said that, the wheat ki qualities of the um, they probably had maybe 9 or 10 or maybe 7 to 8 types of gluten. Aajkal ke wheat mein has more than 100 types of gluten. What is gluten? Is a protein. It's like a sticky or a binding protein which is in grains, mein hota hai, mostly wheat mein sabse zyada hota hai, that is called a gluten. Now, if you have crossbred hai, cross -breed kiya us wheat, ko, to uska jo amount of gluten hai in the older varieties was you know, barely you know, minimal. And in today's varieties, mein gluten is so much and that's the reason a lot of people who were fine or who would have been fine eating wheat of the older ancient varieties probably can't now anymore. 
Okay. Um, so having said that, now let's go back and talk about, um, like I said, I wasn't going to dedicate the topic on read today, but I was going to definitely talk about flowers, but I definitely want to give you some information on people who might still question ki, wheat mein kya galti hai, se theek hota hai. So wanted to give you that insight over there. Um, I know I've done a lot of shows in the past where we've talked quite a bit of detail about wheat and gluten sensitivity and whatnot, but that was the part I wanted to do today right now. So now how to compare different flowers? Having said ki, maybe wheat is not the best option anymore because of the kind of wheat nowadays. So of course there are many different flowers available. Now how do we go and consider which one is best for us, which one um, is best? Now I'll probably post this chart on my Facebook page also, but typically Serving size, if we talk about probably of any flour, we'll talk about maybe about a quarter cup, which is a quarter cup is about, a, you know, four tablespoons is a quarter cup, okay? Now, of course, like I said, we all understand that a lot more flour is available commercially than any other time. You know, they can pretty much make, and they are making flour for everything, anything that's possible, okay? How do we compare one flour to the other flour? Calorie-wise, mostly all the flours I've seen the least do 100 calories, so we're talking about a quarter cup, okay? So the least I've seen is 100 calories. The max, max goes up to about 170 to 180 calories um, in some flowers. Actually, max is maybe about just about 100 and yeah, 180 actually for based upon, you probably won't see that. It's called a sweet rice flour, sweet um, white rice flour. But typically, mostly a lot of the flowers would range anywhere between 100, and, 100 calories to about 160 calories in a quarter cup, okay? Now, so calories aren't making a big difference but it's the kind of calories. So when you look carbs, and again, um, uh, to reiterate what I've talked in the past is, whenever you're comparing two different foods, um, people look at calories, then they look at sugar, then again, a lot of people look at the carbs too. Um, I would definitely suggest you to look at the net carbs, okay? Because that is what, effect, that is, what is affecting weight gain, that is what affecting, is affecting the insulin spike. Okay, so you want to make sure, I know I have a couple callers, I'll get you in just a second, so please keep holding, let me just finish this statement here, but um, but like I mentioned, you make sure you want to make a look, be looking at the net carbs. So, kisi bhi cheese mein jitne bhi total carbs hote hain, fiber hota hai, fiber is mostly counted as a part of the carbs, so when you're looking at net carbs, you're supposed to take the total carbs, subtract the fiber carbs, or the fiber grams, and that's when you get net carbs. Okay, that is what is affecting the insulin because fiber jo hota hai, indigestible hota hai, fiber mein calories nahi hoti hai, even if for whatever reason it's still being counted in most of the labels as a part of the carbs, but you want to make sure that you have total carbs, mein se fiber ko subtract karo, and then you get the net carbs. Uh, let's go and talk to, I guess, Vamshi. Hello, how are you? Very good. How can we help you? Yes, yes. Uh, no, no, definitely. Like I said, there are a couple varieties. You probably won't find it in any of the regular, like a desi store as a flower or something. In corn is what I've been suggesting and I've personally been consuming. It's called in corn. It's a, um, two of them, in corn and kamut, uh, K-A-M-U-T is one brand, uh, one type of wheat and in corn in corn is the most ancient grain um, it's it's spelled as e i n k o r n in corn and a uh, very ancient grain has never been modified it's still the ancient variety in fact an in corn wheat and a regular wheat ka crop ka, if you look at the pictures you'll just find an amazing uh, difference a lot of people have seen even if they have gluten sensitivities they're fine eating in corn so yes, in corn is a variety. You can get it on Amazon. Um, there are two ways you can get in corn, and I'll give you the difference. Either you can get the grain of in corn, or you can get the flour of in corn. Flour, say, of course, you can just make rotis out of it, right? You know, like you non make tortillas and stuff. But sometimes I always suggest people maybe you might want to get the grain also because what you can do is grain. Sometimes in a, you know, just to again mention, not everyone wants to make rotis every day. So in corn, ka jo grain hota, you can also make it as a rice. So sometimes you want to just replace rice and don't want to make rotis and you want to just make rice out of the grain, you can. And if you have a high speed, one of those blenders at home, you can just make your own 
uh, flour out of the incon grains and then make roti out of it. So it's a good option to maybe have both or the grain because like I said, grain can be now used as a rice purpose or as a roti purpose if you could just blend and make flour out of it. You're welcome. Thank you for calling. So that's one incon, very ancient, and another one, uh, quite ancient, but incon is the most ancient one, and then another one is called kamut, K-A-M-U-T. And um, in fact, I probably, since we're talking about that, I could probably share some quick information for you. Um, there was a study that was done where participants were either given kamut, which is an ancient variety of wheat, or modern wheat, okay, for eight weeks each. Okay, kamut wheat caused a reduction in both total and LDL cholesterol compared to modern wheat. Um, it also inc um, increased blood concentration of potassium and magnesium, while these minerals decreased with modern wheat. Modern wheat, since it's so high in gluten and a lot of other, um, of course, uh, the kind of gluten, the protein, so it kind of extracts away a lot of the nutrients. It doesn't have the potassium and the magnesium. So again, to uh, remind, uh, tell you what the study was, though the ke participants liye unko eight, eight weeks ke liye, um, ek ko kamut ke, uh, wheat grain ke, of course, whatever they want to give it to, and the other uh, uh, participants were given the modern wheat. So um, both of the donor sites made the people who were on the kamut um, kind of wheat grain, um, they caused a reduction in total and LDL cholesterol and also the concentration of the potassium and the magnesium body mein bargi, which is, of course, everyone knows potassium and magnesium is very important for you. Kamut also caused a mild reduction in the fasting blood sugar, about three to four so ban. In fact, like I said, insulin jo hai or the fasting blood sugar jo hai wo bhi better hogi body mein. Um, it also led to a major decrease in some, a lot of inflammatory markers, right? And if you know what inflammatory markers, jab bhi aapki body mein doctors ko test karte hain ki aapko gluten sensitivity hai ya thyroid honne wala hai, to basically kya karte hain? Infl inflammatory markers humari body mein hote hain, to unko sense kiya jata hai ki humari body mein kya inflammation hai unko Say, right? So that's typically what happens. So let's say if a person is gluten sensitive or you um, gluten gluten, so what happens in the body? Your body has inflammation. Aa jati hai. Then now you have to do the test or they're trying to do is that inflammatory marker ke saath reaction and see how much your body is in inflammation. Mein hai. So typically what like again to mention, Kamut jo khane se a lot of people uh, unke test mein inflammatory markers jo hai unki concentration bhi kam ho gayi thi and um, so yeah so having mentioned that so like I said bottom line rel relative to older variety wheat varieties modern wheat has adverse effects on cholesterol insulin sugar so you know there are of course like I said there are options available so try either kamut k a m u t or incon, E I N K O R N. In fact, um, to mention that, since we're talking about, there was just about three months ago, um, I remember there was um, some kind of documentary I was watching, and it was a pretty new one, just about came out maybe three, four months back, and they were showing that, you know, I guess they do, they are archaeological people, they're trying to figure out, and they found uh, this remains of a person that was living, I don't know, billions and millions or whatever years ago, and uske, uh, jab uske, dekha, uske last remains mein jo khana tha was grains of ink corn. Um, so that is how back it goes, you know, just to mention. So, interesting. Okay, so again, studio number 408-912-5565, 408-912-5565, yes, studio number, if you have a question, uh, similar, different question related, wheat, you know, wheat is related, uh, diets are related, nutrition is related, sensitivities are related, weight loss, weight gain is related, you're welcome to give us a call, I'll be happy to take a call and answer your question, 408-912-5565. Um, again, you are listening to Rachna and Rachna's Fitness Show. I do come here every Wednesday between 12 o'clock to 1 o'clock. We do take your live calls. And um, information about me, I'm a fitness expert. I'm the owner of Rachna's Wellness. It's a Rachna's Wellness. It's a complete wellness uh, uh, program, solution center that we have here in Sunnyvale, California. Um, Again, the center is located here in Sunnyvale, but our programs are being done, of course, from people worldwide. So I personally have designed all of my programs, and I'm proud to say that. But again, your needs in terms of weight loss, weight gain, health, nutrition, you call kar sakte. have many different programs I've designed specifically for people with different conditions. Or in general, you're just looking to get fit. You want to get rid of 20 pounds. You want to get rid of 30 pounds, 40 pounds. I have had people have lost all the way up to 90 to 100 pounds. And, you know, um, of course, that won't happen in three months. That probably requires maybe a good year. I've had people. I've had people have lost about 80, 90 pounds, and maybe about a little bit more than a year. So yes, it is definitely possible to get fit again. It's just that you have to make that mind within you that you're just tired of gaining that weight. You're just tired of um, taking medication. You're just tired of looking this way. So if that is something that's been bugging you, um, and you know there's something that needs to be done, give me a call. I'd be happy to help you. 
um, guide you, coach you, work out with you, teach you, whatever that it requires. Again, to get it registered, our um, many different programs are. Just to mention one of our programs called the Ultimate Fat Burner. Ultimate Fat Burner is starting this coming Monday. It is a program that can be done absolutely remotely. In fact, it is designed to be done absolutely remotely. That means you don't have to come physically down to the center any time. It is a complete program that is divided into levels. Every level, हम अलग अलग हिस्से exercises पे काम करेंगे, complete desi meal plans पे काम करेंगे, and then we move on to a different level as per your progress. So I'm dividing the whole three month course into a level based program, and um, again the program, the ultimate fat burner is starting this coming Monday, Monday more uh, Monday. So again to get registered um, or to get more information or come and talk to me, आप call कर सकते हैं four zero eight three twenty eight one 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 four zero eight three two zero Eight one one one. You can also get information on the website rachnaradio dot com. R A C H N A rachnaradio dot com. And if you forget the website, just go in Google or type Rachna's Wellness Center, Rachna's Wellness, and it should come up there too. Okay. So moving on again, story number four zero eight nine one two five five six five. Okay, so we're talking about different flowers. Okay, so I kind of told you about you know why wheat won't be the best option, and then having said that, I kind of talked about is there are of course a lot of different flowers you know available outside. How to compare? So one thing I of course told you is you're supposed to compare not just the calories. Um, you were also supposed to look at the net carbs because calories से ज़्यादा आपकी जो carbs होते हैं body में वो फर्क पड़ते हैं. So net carbs calculate करने के लिए you're supposed to take the total carbs, subtract the fiber out of it, and that's when you get net carbs. And I'll share some numbers of some really good carb options for you um, in just a while. So keep listening. Um, so like I said, one of course I wanted to explain you the difference between flowers versus starches. Okay, so, and I, and I think that specifically applies to let's say corn flour, corn starch, right? You might have heard this, and that applies to in fact, काफी अलग अलग चीजों में ये चीजें आती हैं. But especially corn में आपने हमेशा नाम सुना होगा या तो corn flour होता है या corn starch होता है. What is the difference? Okay, so there's always a confusion between flowers and starches. In some cases, um, it's probably the same when it comes to let's say tapioca, because they're both the same. What pretty pretty much what's the difference is that that the flowers are made from dried ground grains or nuts and have the protein and the fiber intact, whereas the starches have the fiber and the protein removed, leaving pure nearly pure carbohydrates. Right. So imagine करो आपने almonds लेके उस पूरे को छिलके के समेत पीस दिया. So that is not going to be called an almond starch. It's going to be called an almond flour or an almond meal. If somehow we take the skin out, I would take some of the protein out, a lot of the protein out, and then I make a flour again. That wouldn't be purely possible in almond, but that would be, and that's typically what is different between corn flour and corn starch. Okay, corn flour is an entire corn um, ground up corn flour, or just cook uh, corn meal be called that. But corn starch. Is purely, uh, you know, purely the starch left of it. Okay, so that's the difference between corn flour and corn starch. Okay, okay. Um, so now let's go and talk about the best ones. Like I said, I already talked about traditional flours like the beet flours are maybe not the best. Okay, starches, rice flours, which are often used in a lot of gluten-free baking. Me, kafi log starch use karte hain, uh, potato flour use karte hain, log rice flour use karte hain, um, what not. Um, you know, they of course are a different option, and they're kind of on the bottom of the chart. And if I give you which are the best, so let's go and talk about which are the best flour that we could possibly use. सबसे पहले आता है flax meal, brown golden कोई भी तरह का flax meal, and and I have a very simple reason why. Flax meal में net carbs zero होते हैं. Carbs eight grams होते हैं. We're talking about a quarter cup, remember, of all of these servings. Um, total carbs उसमें eight grams होते हैं. Fiber भी eight grams होता है. That means the net carbs are going to be zero. Okay. So even if we think that the calories are high, which is 120 grams, but a lot of them are just coming from the protein and the good part. But typically, the net carbs are carbs minus fiber in flax meal. Okay, net carbs are zero. So especially for people with um, maybe you know diabetes or insulin sensitivity or maybe having pre-diabetic condition, please try to include as much flax meal in your you know diet as possible because the net carbs zero है. That means आपका insulin shoot नहीं होगा उसको खाने से. Okay. Um, the next one on the list is hazelnut flour or hazelnut meal की तरह भी इसको कहा जाएगा. Again, net carbs two. Um, almond flour, almond meal, net carbs three. Okay. Um, in, now let me go and tell you about whole wheat flour. Whole wheat flour में net carbs are nineteen. Total carbs twenty three होते हैं. Fiber four grams होता है. That means the net carbs is going to be twenty three minus four. 
So whole wheat flour has net carbs 19 grams per a quarter cup. Okay, so let's go and talk about the, the worst one, potato starch, potato starch flour. And a lot of people who are on gluten-free sensitivity, um, they in fact use a lot of potato flour. In fact, a lot of the gluten breads, gluten-free breads, ingredients, you'll find a lot of these starch flours added. So please be careful. It's very easy to increase your um, carb intake your, or mess up your insulin, especially if you're on a gluten-free diet, specifically when you're buying breads from outside because most of them are going to be either made from some kind of starch, like pure potato starch, tapioca uh, flour or starch, and you'll see that. If you go and look at the ingredients of breads, which specifically mention gluten-free, unke upar ingredients are mostly a lot of brown rice flour, white rice flour, um, potato starch. So again, to mention, um, brown rice flour, ke net carbs are 29, white rice flour 31, potato starch is 40. 40 net carbs, that is a lot in just a quarter cup versus flax meal had zero net carbs in a quarter cup. Again, whole wheat flour, which we are mostly aata banta hai, is 19 net carbs. Okay, so just wanted to give you that option over there. So make sure that you're eating the right kind of carbs. If there aren't plenty of options available out there. Yes, of course, um, desi diet ke saath, there's some changes you might have to do. Sab ke saath ap aise roti to nahi bana sakte ho, but of course, you know, it's worth giving it a try because like I said, um, it's, the, the, you know, there are a lot of options available outside than just only always having, you know, wheat flour. Maybe try to add them a little by little to your flour. So let's say a roti bana ho, you don't want to make it a pure wheat flour, you know, try to add some flax meal, uh, flax uh, flour to it. Maybe you can add some almond flour to it. It's is going to give maybe a little bit nutty taste. You can also add some, um, a little bit of coconut flour to it. You can also add some, I'm trying to give you a list of the lower um, then. So I think those are the best options. Uh, quinoa ka flour hai, just to mention, you know, but not that it's so low in carbs. But so yeah, so those are the good options. You can actually make a good combination. Um, I've never been a fan of soy flour, you know, so I probably would take it out. I know soy flour is again lower on the thing, but I think soy is just not, you know, first of all, a lot of the soy is GMO. Uh, genetically modified and the second of course soy is um, not even a complete protein so it's not one of the most um, what I would say the best protein option that you would be intaking for yourself so okay um, let's see so we've talked about wheat flour so again if you have a question I would be happy to take a call our studio number is 408-912-5565 408-912-5565 Five five six five. Yes, today's number. If you're interested in giving us a call, question hai. Aap abhi call kar sakte hain. Ya fir agar aap mere se mil ke baat karna chahte hain. Uh, you wanna come and talk to me, or you wanna talk to me over the phone about any of the different programs, or if you just need a consultation to see exactly what your goal should be, where are you heading, what changes you need to be made. I'll be happy to do that. Aap call kar sakte hain. Hamare business number pe four zero eight three twenty eight one one one. Again. Um, I'm the owner of Rachna's Wellness. You're welcome to give me a call. I'd be happy to talk to you. We can talk over the phone, sit together and talk in my center in Sunnyvale. Phone number is 408-320-8111. Again, to mention the Ultimate Fat Burner. Ultimate Fat Burner. I'm really excited about this program because I'm really putting everything, all the effort into it. And the name says it all, Ultimate Fat Burner. I'll make sure that you have three months. Um, I know holidays are coming. Now, there are two people. एक तरह के लोग होते हैं तो बोलेंगे अब तो छुट्टियां आ रही हैं अब क्या छुट्टियों के बाद करेंगे और एक तरह के लोग होते हैं छुट्टियां आ रही हैं कुछ गलत हो जाएगा लेट्स जस्ट कीप एवरीथिंग बैक ऑन ट्रैक सो यू नो इट डिपेंड्स ऑन आप कौन सी साइड पे हो आई वुड रादर कीप माय सेल्फ ऑन ट्रैक अगेन ऑलवेज रिमेंबर एंड अगेन नॉट रिमेंबर बट अ लॉट ऑफ पीपल नो मी आई यू नो आई विल मेक श्योर दैट यू आर ईटिंग राइट बट आई विल डेफिनेटली गिव यू प्लेंटी ऑफ ऑप्शंस टू गो इंडल्ज इन द थिंग्स यू वांटेड टू इंडल्ज जस्ट मेक श्योर दैट वी कम एंड बर्न इट ऑफ अगर इफ यू यू नो एंड इट अप हैविंग समथिंग रॉन्ग इन द 3 मंथ प्रोग्राम सो I'll definitely give you a lot of options to not always be sticking on a good healthy meal plan. You'll definitely get options um, to go eat the things you wanted to eat and of course come back and burn it off. So that's how the programs are designed. <coughs> okay, so studio number pe aap call. Okay, I think we kind of lost the signal. We're back again. Let's take a next caller. We're going to be talking to Anu. Hi, Anu. How are you? I'm very good. How can we help you? Um, Anu, your voice got very much cut off. I really couldn't hear what you said. Can you please say it again? Oh, no, no, you can. 
can talk, you can have a different question if it's, uh, of course, related to some health, fitness related topic, but no, you can definitely ask a different question. <coughs> millet flour, M-I-L-L-E-T. Millet is, sure, I will definitely take care of that question. Uh, millet, of course, um, just to mention, millet is, um, English mein millet kehte hain, but India, uh, mare Hindi mein millet, hi, alag alag versions hote hain millet ke. Um, ye hum, usko, of course, ja, uh, jawar flower hota hai, and then we also get the other different flowers. So, millet is a more general name. Um, millet, again, yes, it is a very good, it's a, it's more of a complete protein. Iska jo fiber content zada hota hai millet mein. Millet ki, um, Insulin spike bhi bhaat kam hota hai, net carbs humare regular wheat flour se kam hote hai. So I will definitely suggest millet and I think millet is one of the flowers that's been suggested for years um, for even for people who have some kind of um, insulin resistance problem. So yes, millet is something that you definitely, you know, as much you can include in your diet. Millet ke, um, aap millet ko in fact boil karke uski khichdi ki tarah bhi bana sakte, you can mix some dal and something along with it. But yes, millet is, well, thanks for bringing that point, but millet is an amazing um, healthy option they can definitely add um, you know, to any option. In fact, I've seen a lot of uh, salads nowadays having millet. They, of course, they boil it and they also have millet. You can also sprout millet. That's another good option. But millet is definitely a very good option. They can add any different way. It's definitely, um, it reduces the insulin spike way less. It's going to have insulin spike than regular beet flour. So, okay. We have some callers, but we're going to go talk to Nav first. Nav from Shore Media. Hi, Nav. How are you? Oh, I guess we don't have him. We have, we're going to be, in fact, we have some other callers, but we will definitely be talking to, um, let's say, we will be talking to Nitu. Hi, Nitu, how are you? Hello. Um, question. Um, I would say, in fact, I've had different options. So, of course, there's one option. The store-bought ones, I probably wouldn't get it, you know. And the reason is because, first of all, a lot of the store-bought, sometimes they don't even write it. All it says is multigrain atta. So, what multigrain are we talking about? Many times, I'm not going to go in the brand names, but I've many times in the brand names, all it says is multigrain atta. But ingredients really don't mention what grains and multigrains and everything are they using. And a lot of the time, multigrains are, again, um, some combination of soy flour and soy grain and I'm not a big fan of soy flour either way so um, having said that and so that's one thing I really would make it at home yourself um, you know you can always get all different flours all you need to do is you don't have to do it separately every time when you make your rotis you can just mix it up together for a month and take all different flours and whatever combination and just make it ready for you so it's not something that to be done every single time you make rotis so put 50 of this 22 parts of this three parts you have something ready now now to go back and talk about what flowers and what combinations um would work um one of course like I was mentioning the other person if you're going with wheat um yes you can stick to the regular wheat but if you really want to be even healthier then you can of course go to the ancient variety of wheat which is either the kamut or the ain corn or if you want to stick to the you know, regular variety of wheat, that's fine. So that's, I would say the more wheat flour would probably give the good consistency of roti. If you add anything else, the roti ki consistency is, is what best. So I'll probably give four parts to wheat, um, you know. And the next three parts could be um, either ragi flour or it could also be the millet flour, okay. Um, and the next part could be um, either you can add, the next two parts would be the flaxseed flour like I was mentioning. And the last part, you can do the black chana flower, not the basin, but the black chana flower that has the skin on with it. That's another way of having actually a lot of fiber in the body and more di uh, protein too. So four parts, wheat, and again, wheat could be the regular wheat, or if you want to make it even healthier than the ancient wheat that we talked about. Um, and then the three parts would be... Like I said, it could be, um, so again, all you're doing is, again, you'll have to kind of play a little and see what is the best combination your family likes. But those are the three or four things that you can blend together, four is to three is to two is to one, and they should make a good combination. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you for calling. 
Okay. So going back again to our um, studio number, hai, Mara, abhi aap call karna hai, 408-912-5565, 408-912-5565. Okay. Aps and Rashna ko Rashna is fitness show. Pay, do come every Wednesday, 12 to 1. We do take your live calls. Um, we talk about health, nutrition, fitness. Um, kisi bhi tarak question aap call kar sakte, it could be related to the topic or it could not be related to the topic as long as it's related to some kind of health, fitness, weight gain. Some research you've heard, you want to get some clarification, um, I'll be happy to talk to you. Phone number again, studio can I have 408-912-5565. Aap sin rahe Rachna ko Rachna's fitness show pe. And if you want to be in touch with me, get registered in any of our complete weight loss programs. Um, there are many different programs, just to mention few. We have programs like post-pregnancy weight loss program. We also have a pre-pregnancy weight loss program. We also have a Just Abs program, level one. We have Just Abs level two. Then we also have a 30-day Desi Fitness Challenge. And then we also have our new program that's starting this coming Monday, a new batch of this program called um, the Ultimate Fat Burner, like the name says it all. It is called an Ultimate Fat Burner. That means we're going to burn as much fat as possible in a fantastic way. I'm going to be working with you complete exercise programs. You're going to be exercising with me from home. Now, this program is completely made in this way that you can do it from home. It's a program that you will actually be reporting to me on a daily basis. Your daily weight measurements it's a, it's a program that's going to, just to put it simple, it's going to just keep you on track. Complete three-month weight loss program called Ultimate Fat Burner starts this Monday morning. To get registered, get information, come and talk to me or over the phone. I'm call kar sakte hain 408-320-8111, 408-320-8111. We're going to be talking to Sonia. Hi, Sonia, how are you? Very good. How can we help you? Okay, so I'll probably have to ask you a couple questions, maybe around um, is, I'm not going to, I don't know if you want to share his weight, but at least tell me, is he overweight? Do you see a belly or a pouch or he does not? Okay, so that's okay. So he's underweight. And anyone else, your uh, immediate family, not your mom, but someone in your family has been you, are you, do you have any kind of diabetes or anything of that sort? So now, yeah. Now, does he have diabetes one or two? Okay. Okay. Right. Hmm. Okay. What is, do you want to tell, if you want to share what number are they getting when they do the test? If you're... So 1995, right. That is higher for his age. Now, having said that, there's a couple of things that I would want to ask. When he did the test, was this a fasting test or was it after meal or before meal or what time of the day did he test? Morning fasting test that he got it done. Right. Do you have, do you, do you have a blood test machine at home, like a glucose sensitive testing machine at home? No. I would suggest you get one. It is very, let's, 
Yeah, I would say get one. I mean, you can get those for 10, 15, 20 dollars, whatever. Get one of those things. And especially if there is a trend, you or in the family, whatever is a good thing to have it. Um, and trust it. And not that I'm saying there are times when the tests are for whatever reason. Maybe you knew he was going for a test and sometimes kids just stress out for that reason. He was scared of the blood test and many times stress, of course, shoots up insulin too. And I'm just saying, you know, that could be, that could not be the case. So I would definitely suggest you to get one at home and just when he's all relaxed and nothing to worry him, just ask him you want to test it. So he's not stressed out that he's going to the doctor, getting a test done that for whatever reason the numbers went up. So I would definitely suggest that because, um, so get one at home in the next, you know, week or so, just test it, you know, tell him you want to test something, but don't give him too much information. Don't let him stress out over it at all. Okay, and try to do it a couple times of the day, maybe here and there, maybe one you can try to do it after a meal too. Um, that having, you know, that's one thing. And again, if the numbers still come higher up, you know, um, a lot of people even, is, is he involved in some kind of fitness activities in school and stuff? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And he's right. Yeah. And then you're giving and not now, not after the test, but even before the test, he's always eaten healthy. Not, not something that changed after you got the test done, even before. Uh, no. Right. Yeah. fine kids do that there's nothing i mean kids shouldn't be devoid of all of this stuff you know right right no don't don't like i said don't get scared it's a good thing you know you know this Yeah, like I said, do, do, do test the numbers again, please. I would definitely suggest you get one of the machine home. Don't take him to the hospital. Don't let him stress or freak out over it. Just get it tested at home and see what the numbers come. If they still come to be high, suggestions would be, um, one, of course, I'll probably suggest maybe grapefruit juice. Grapefruit, I know it's a little, um, you know, uh, bitter for kids, but add some namak and maybe make it somehow tastier and give him a glass of grapefruit juice in the morning, one or two times a day. Um, I would probably start making a lot of methi at home, you know, methi is a definitely fantastic way of getting uh, insulin back in control. So try those couple of things, like I said, if for whatever reason, if the numbers are higher, um, oh well, you can make some healthy changes, maybe a little bit more than what you've already been doing and get the numbers back in control and I don't think that should be a problem at all. For now, I'm thinking for some reason it just came up, just because he was stressed out, but do that the first thing first and call me if you have more questions later, but just, just get the test done at home. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you for calling. Okay. I know we had some other callers which had to hang up, but I'm going to move on to... So we're still going to be open, so you're welcome to give us a call back. But the next caller we have online here is, I guess, Deepa or Deepta. Hello. How are you? Sure. Okay. Now, millet in general hasn't, millet and thyroid, I know, of course, if I put it this way, if you type two words together, let's say if I type millet and thyroid, or if I type millet and diabetes, you'll always find something information online. You will always, there's some combination that's always been come up with whatever two word combinations you put on and everything who does online research will agree that with me, uh, whatever combination. In general, millet, like I said, is a grain um, that's never been um, first of all, it's not all non-GMO because a lot of the grains, the hamarij regular wheat grains hai, soy hai, wheat hai, corn hai, these are the ones that are mass produced. Anything that's mass produced are the ones that have been modified quite a bit. Anything that's a smaller scale has never been mass produced. Uh, so that means they're still more safer. Of course, they'll put, you know, pesticides and everything in the soil. Uh, but again, the grain itself hasn't been genetically modified. So it's very safer to eat these grains that have not been mass produced to say that. And, um, 
So I would definitely suggest you to incorporate millet. How you would incorporate millet? Millet, like I said, um, no specific, not too much specific connections have been made between millet and thyroid. Of course, like I said, you'll find everything online, but millet definitely has reduced um, insulin in a lot of people, insulin sensitivity, I mean, um, and the fasting blood glucose too in a lot of people. And how you would include millet? Millet, of course, like I said, you can make it again like i was mentioning with end corn you can boil it and you can also make it as rice um you can boil it you can saute a little bit and you can add it to salads or you can just make flour out of it if you have a you know one of those blenders at home and you can just make millet flour and then make rotis of course the pure millet rotis won't really get the same texture as rotis but you'll probably have to add some kind of either wheat flour some other combination to give it the good holding power and you can definitely include millet quite a bit base but millet has been um, added to a diet many different ways. The answer question? Millet is not, not that I've heard of. Like I said, if you go find anything with goitrogen and millet, you'll probably consider. Millet doesn't, there's no reason why millet would do that, but send me an article. Maybe you want to send me a link and I can go do more research on this topic, but I personally have not heard of this option. No. So if you're, yeah, go ahead. you're welcome to send me some. I'll be happy to do as much research, which I do. I love to read. So send me some link on my Facebook page and tell me exactly what and where, then I'll do all the related research and then get back to you. You're welcome. You're welcome. Thank you. Um, so yeah, you can always contact me and send me some, get me more information on my Facebook page, facebook.com slash Rachna Radio. I'll be happy to look into it. Okay. So again, like I said, we do had, uh, we had some more colors. They hung up or actually they got disconnected because we were holding for a while. So you're welcome to give us a call. We do have some lines open now. Uh, studio can number here, 408-912-5565, 408-912-5565. Okay, so again, absent Rain Rashna Ko Rashna's fitness show. Pay, do come here every Wednesday between 12 o'clock to 1 o'clock. We do take your live calls. If you have a question, hai, exercise related, fitness related, nutrition related, you call kar sakte hai. Or in general, if you are ready to get started with one of my complete weight loss programs to make a change, make a difference, um, look different this holiday season and just feel amazing about yourself, stay on track. We do have a complete ultimate fat burner, a three month course, um, fantastically designed by me starting this Monday. So it's called the Ultimate Fat Burner, starts this Monday. And so if you're interested in being a part of this program or being a part of this badge or trying to get information more about this program to see how this would work, we'll be happy to talk to you. Again, the Ultimate Fat Burner is starting this Monday. Give us a call, 408-320-8111, 408-320-8111. You can also uh, contact me through my Facebook page, facebook.com slash Rachna Radio, or visit my website, rachnaradio.com, R-A-C-H-N-A, rachnaradio.com. Okay, um, what else? Okay, so this was our but of course I wanted to talk, I know we have some more callers holding. In fact, let's go and take some calls and then I'll come back. Um, Jaya, hi Jaya, how are you? Yes, millet is also called bajra, but millet is an English name, so if you see that Hindi is also called bajra, and ragi is also called ragi, generally, if you American name, you get most of the millet's name. Yes, but round millet is also called bajra, then it's a little shape of the but in English, you can see most of the millet is called bajra, but in Hindi, it's also called bajra, but it's also called bajra, but ragi is also called bajra, it's also called bajra, I don't remember the name of Hindi, but there are two or three different ways in Hindi, which they call bajra, 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 which में जिनको कहा जाता है तो उनको इंग्लिश में राउंड मिलेट कह देते हैं या देर डिफरेंट शेप्स इन हाइन कार्ड होता है बट आप वही जैसे अभी आपने आई डोंट आपने मेरा पहले टॉपिक सुना वहां पे बात हो रही थी यहां पे सिर्फ कार्ड की बात नहीं हो रही फाइबर की बात भी होती है तो अगर किसी भी चीज में फाइबर ज्यादा है तो उसके जो नेट कार्ब्स हैं वो कम हो जाते हैं मोस्टली जब लेबल्स बनाए जाते हैं लेबल के ऊपर टोटल कार्ब्स देखे जाते हैं कि 20 है 15 है 10 है बट आप देखो उसके अंदर फाइबर कितना है उसके फाइबर को उसके सब्ट्रैक्ट करके वो नेट कार्ब्स आएंगे तो यस लाइक आई सेड मिलेट इज नॉट ऑन द टॉप ऑफ द लिस्ट व्हेन इट कम्स टू कार्ब्स आई एम सॉरी इन व्हेन इट कम्स टू द हेल्दीएस्ट वन इन टर्म्स ऑफ की सबसे कम कार्ब्स हैं सबसे उसके लिए तो आई हैव ऑलरेडी मेंशन फ्लैक्स मील जीरो नेट कार्ब्स होते हैं
फ्लैक्स मील को नहीं आप बात कर रहे हैं फ्लैक्स सीड की ना फ्लैक्स में ऑफकोर्स अब फ्लैक्स फ्लावर को नहीं फ्लैक्स फ्लावर तो बहुत लोग बेकिंग भी करते हैं इनफैक्ट इट्स हाँ जी यस नो इट्स फ्रॉम फ्लैक्स सीड नो जिस फ्लैक्स सीड लेके आप उनको पीस दोगे दैट इज वॉट फ्लैक्स मील और फ्लैक्स फ्लावर दैट नो दैट प्रॉब्लम वन बी द केस लाइक इस दैट फ्लैक्स मील से तो इनफैक्ट काफी लोग बेकिंग करते हैं ऑफ कोर्स द गोल इज दैट कोई भी चीज को भाई जितना भी रॉक खा सकते हैं इज ऑलवेज द बेस्ट एंड दैट्स व्हाट आई टेल पीपल कि अपनी डाइट में कॉम्बिनेशन होना चाहिए कई चीज रॉ भी होनी चाहिए कई पार्शली कुक भी होनी चाहिए कई थोड़ी हमारे रेगुलर कुक भी होंगे सो यस ऑफ कोर्स हर चीज का बेनिफिट रॉ का अलग होता है फॉर एग्जाम्पल लेट से रॉ नट्स का बेनिफिट अलग होता है बट द सेम टाइम रॉ नट्स में मैं बहुत डिटेल में जाऊंगी रॉ नट्स में एक बहुत हाई होता है जिसको लेक्टिन कहा जाता है वो लेक्टिन कम करने के लिए कई बार कहा जाता है नट्स को थोड़ा सा रोस्ट कर लो तो हर चीज का बेनिफिट भी है तो इसलिए ओवेज थल की मेक अ कॉम्बिनेशन लाइफ स्टाइल कि कोई वेजिटेबल्स रॉ भी जाने चाहिए आपके अंदर कोई ग्रेन्स रॉ भी जाने चाहिए कोई थोड़े से कोको के भी जाने चाहिए कि बॉडी गेट्स अ कॉम्बिनेशन ऑफ एवरीथिंग दैट यू नीड राइट राइट आई एम सॉरी जया आई डू हैव वन लास्ट हाँ जी जया मुझे आपको हम सॉरी आई हैव टू डिस्कनेक्ट आप मुझे प्लीज अगले शो में कॉल करें वापस कॉल करें कपल मोर पीपल होल्डिंग एंड आई ऑल्सो हैव टू टॉक फ्रॉम नै फ्रॉम शोर मीडिया बट थैंक यू फॉर कॉलिंग आई एम सॉरी फॉर कॉलेज डिस्कनेक्टिंग यू गन बी थैंकिंग आई नो वी ट्रॉन गेट होल्ड ऑफ नै फ्रॉम शोर मीडिया हेलो हाउ वी यू हाँ बिल्कुल ठीक है हम बस शो की वेट कर रहे हैं अब तो बहुत एक्साइटमेंट बढ़ रही है एरिया में इनफैक्ट टिकट तो पता सारी सोल्ड आउट हो जा रही है वट इज गोइंग ऑन हियर Yes, I can see that happening here. Yes, tell me more. So it's we're just happening this weekend. So Oakland me ho raha hai ye show. Ab thodi si aur details dein hame. Wow. Wow. Very nice. Fantastic, and so again happening this Saturday. Starts at seven, but of course be there at six o'clock. Tickets के लिए भी वो कहाँ visit करें? Tell me that go to Suleika. dot com, right? Fantastic. Thanks, Nev. Okay, so again, show is happening this um, Saturday, 7 p.m. Our train. You can get tickets. Take them. Sonu Nigam, Atif Aslam. I mean, this combination cup will get. See, it's an amazing duo that's going to be happening. So happening this Saturday. So get your tickets. Okay, so wrapping up. Absent. Rahe the. Rashna ko Rashna's fitness show. I very apologize. I feel bad. So I know there are a lot of calls. I couldn't get to them. In fact, Jaya ko bhi hamen disconnect karna pada tha. Please, sorry if you're still listening. Give us a call next show. Later, bhi ab call kar sakte hain show ke baad. Again, to get registered any of our complete programs, we do have a complete three month weight loss program called Ultimate Fat Burner starting this Monday. To get registered, come and talk to me. Ultimate Fat Burner. It is going to be a three-month course that stays, keeps you on track. It's going to make you lose a lot of weight, lots of fat. Fantastic program and designing. I'm really excited about it. Starts this Monday. Ultimate Fat Burner. To get registered, give us a call four zero eight three two zero eight one 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 four zero eight three twenty eight triple one. You can also check out the information on the program. Give us a call. Contact us through my website, Rachna Radio dot com. R A C H N A Rachna Radio dot com. Yeah, for Facebook, you can also contact us at Facebook dot com. Rachna Radio. I'll be again here next Wednesday. Till then, keep fit and keep working out.